What's up everybody, welcome back to The Heads Project, I'm John Ordalaza, and today we're going to be reacting to the first official teaser for Marvel Studios' brand new film, not Doctor Strange, no, it's the one right after it, Thor Love and Thunder, it's here, the first teaser's here, after breaking the record of being the shortest amount of time between its first teaser and the film's release, we finally got a first look, so stay tuned for my reaction. Okay. They were once used for battle. Now they're but humble tools for peace. Yeah, this film looks beautiful. <laughs> Holy crap. Exactly who I am. <laughs> I want to choose my own path. Hey! Guardians! Okay. My superhero days are over. Where everything is a little bright blue sky. Damn. Dude, this film looks so beautiful. Remember what I told you? You ever feel lost? Hey. Look into the eyes of the people that you love. Hey, the Guardians! <laughs> what? Just listening. Yo! Look at that. Look, hey, hey, you know, you know what I mean? You just gotta show me some cool stuff. <laughs> I, I think all the visuals in this trailer, this teaser, I should say, that was the biggest standout. All of the beautiful shots, the cinematography, the colors are popping. Because this is Taika Waititi, dude. Like, this is what he brought to Thor Ragnarok. That sounds like a very dark and downer uh, topic for a Thor film. You know, Ragnarok, the end of all things, and, you know, for Norse mythology and whatnot. But this movie has that same vibe, that same uh, feeling of Ragnarok, but Love and Thunder, whatever those uh, themes are going to be. We got Jane Foster back. Natalie Portman is returning as her character Jane Foster, but as female Thor. So that's intriguing. I'm excited to see that. She looks badass, dude. She really does. And, dude, the Guardians are in here. There's so much going on in this, in this little... A minute and a half teaser that it's getting me excited already, dude. Like the premise alone of this movie and just hearing the cast and the characters that are coming in were already enough. But now that we have something tangible, this tr this little teaser, it's getting my blood pumping again. So guys, let me know down below, what did you think of this teaser trailer, this official teaser of Thor Love and Thunder? And are you excited for the film? And what are your wild uh, theories? Let me know down below. I'm surprised we didn't get to see any uh, Gore the God Butcher. Or maybe we did and I missed him or something. Just let me know down below, what's your favorite shot of the trailer? I personally thought that was funny of like, you know, uh, Thor thought that... Quill was talking to him about love and whatnot, and he was just trying to look at the other Guardians. <laughs> that was funny. I, I enjoyed the banter between the two, and I can't wait to see more of it in this film. Leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Be on the lookout for my Moon Knight reviews. I'm posting reviews for each episode of Moon Knight every single week. Episode 4 is coming this Wednesday, so you might want to stick around, because there is more to come.